CindyLittleWellness.com. I'm here to give you your nutrition tip of the day. Today we're going to talk about copper. The reason why you want to learn about copper is because it's involved in the healing process and energy production. It also helps with hair and skin coloring and taste sensitivity. So if you got bad taste buds, it um, might have to do with a copper insufficiency. It's needed for healthy nerves and joints and collagen. Early signs of deficiency are osteoporosis, so weakening of the bones, anemia, baldness, skin sores, general weakness, and diarrhea. Food sources can include almonds, pecans, avocados, barley, broccoli, beans, uh, beets, blackstrap molasses, oranges, salmon, seafood, and leafy green vegetables. Copper levels are depleted if your zinc or vitamin C go up. So if you are, if you have a cold and you think, I'm going to take some vitamin C because I have a cold, well, that could deplete your copper sources. So I've got the solution for you guys. This is what I use. I use multivitamins that come in an AM, PM pack. And there's a number of different things in here. So if you're just taking vitamin C, that's not going to be good enough because, again, it will lower copper, it will lower other, other um, vitamins and minerals in your body. So we have um, packets that safely have everything in it. And the great thing about our product is that it, you can read all of the ingredients in it, and copper is one of them. So if you want to help your healing process, energy production, and avoid osteoporosis, take a multivitamin that um, you can count on that has the right amounts of everything. That's your tip for today on copper.